I guess we better arm. bathe. <laughs> Should I have combed my hair? I didn't comb my hair. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the Over 30 Clan. Motorsport 7 yeah, Winter Series on. Race Number 8. <laughs> the shenanigans in the background. We prepare for the race of a lifetime. Twenty laps. Twenty laps. We're bringing you to the uh, the Swiss Alps in uh, Viennese Festival map. This track has a couple really tight turns, but mostly open and wide. Turns lying uh, a lot of really fast racing and currently running an A class. I'm not supposed to be on ready or anything yet, right? No, don't do that yet. No, okay. I'm setting the I really wanted to do that little three wheeled BMW, but. No, you don't. I <laughs> It's a piece of shit car. I know. You, you, I can't. Was... No, no, no. Don't, don't listen to him. That fucking car is great. <laughs> it was kind of a toss up between that. Slow uh, pregame shenanigans while we wait for the rest of the drivers to hit their post. Yeah, but it's fast. And... It is fast. <laughs> you just keep all the wheels on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> So Delray's not in here? Yeah. Nope. Okay. He put a thing in the Forza thing that he wasn't going to be off tonight. Uh, he said, don't wait up. He, he may not make it. He said it was kind of close. No. No race, yeah. And... This crap. That little old car thing. He's got 9.2. So <sighs> okay. So let's run through the poll here. We got, so it's reverse order for you new people. So lowest points is in the front. And point leaders are in the back. So we got, and I just went alphabetical since Sneaky and Search are new. So uh, Sneaky and Search. Then we got Lad, Punk who's not here. Fed who's now dog, dog cow. <laughs> Red's not here. Nitty, Toucan, Nita, Noble, Ricky, Cold, Before, Pono. Since Delray's not here, Vin, me, Kev, Fat, and then Old Praise is just spectating. Hey, so, just so you know, Fed is no longer Fed because it sounds like Fat. His name is Moof. I, I said Dog Cow. <laughs> His I, name yeah, Moof. Moof Fed Black. now Dog Cow. <laughs> you know, so, I, uh, that's who I, I tried that. changing it to Moof, but uh, it was already taken. We'll get back to the drivers in a second. Actually, yeah. okay. And I don't okay. even have like a name with a bunch of A's and X's and, you know. Sneaky like search and lad, ready up, yeah. please. That's sneaky. Okay. Said sneaky yeah. search and lad. Uh -oh. <laughs> uh, hey, 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 you know, know everybody been drinking. There's not ready. Why is he not ready? <laughs> not sneaky. Not has to ready up still. That's what you click. You click that if you don't. Oh. This is. Yeah. We well, still got to go to race, and then Black's gonna have to change the order real quick. So, yeah, second. Sounds like somebody killing my wife. What? <laughs> What? No, she's in there watching Duke Carolina game where they see Steve Carlin. He wasn't ready on Mario. Barely March. Yeah. Well, she should still be able to ready up here, I think. Yeah, the ready now. Oh. I'm just waiting for all the stuff to. Oh, now you're unready. <laughs> Am I ready or not ready? Uh, you're killing me, Smalls. You're not ready. Ready up. She's not showing ready. Uh, yeah. there you don't there touch you anything. Don't do anything. Yeah, don't okay. touch none. <laughs> okay. So, sneaky search and a refresher for Lad, who hasn't been here. controller down. <laughs> there's a pace lap, okay? This first lap, you yeah. just keep a pace of 60, 70 ish miles an hour. You know, if it's a long, easy straight, you can speed up a little, but try to keep it as consistent as you can. And then, as soon as you cross the start finish line, <clears throat> Everyone, as soon as you start the start finish line, you can take off. Um, if you bump into somebody that results in a spin out or a loss of position because of that bump, you're supposed to have the honor system of a stop and go. Mary. Um, <laughs> Mary. <laughs> um, and then, you know, basically just call out your passing best you can. And uh, that's really it for the rules. We're no, just no, setting up the, uh, the post positions and 
Go over the rule set for the drivers. Uh, yeah, yeah, my bad. Uh, today we're going to be racing the uh, Venice okay. Alps. First lap is the pace uh, in Switzerland. And on the first um, lap, very open, uh, okay, weavy lap, get a race dirty track lap. with only a few really so tight turns. So your, this should be really exciting, fast time, ride. We're currently driving your uh, A series vehicles. Lap will be your best time. So if everybody's and this going is race slow, number eight of lap, the Winter Classic over three to clan four to seven lap for you. So we'll just uh, listen back in on the drivers lap, while we so uh, prepare the marker, our post positions and get ready to start. Or something like that. Yep. All right. Everybody ready? Yep. Ready. Yep. All right. Good luck. Fingers crossed that this loads. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. You got this. Thing. You got this. Oh, cool. you got it. All right. It looks good. good. We're going to click start. I, I assume you're, you're good, Opre. Oh, yeah. All right. Thank you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Clean, man. <laughs> and obviously keep your position man. best you can. Yep. Everybody in. Mm -hmm. yep. And I am your spectator, Opre, taking you through the race today. Should be a pretty exciting one. A lot of people showed up this evening. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I, I, I was going to hit search and destroy, so I was. You're going to hit me? Sorry, I had to change my view just for this. Oh, oh no problem. Try to. Get right back up. Search uh, with um... all the way up in the front. All right. Yep. Yeah, on the right side of. Yeah, this left column's going a lot faster than the right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This is this part is by far the hardest part of the race. Really <laughs> <laughs> hard. Oh, it's hard. Well, not What's up, man? Let's get the uh, camera going here. Cruise control. That's a reverse hood. So remember to run over the edges to get a dirty lap. Uh, so it, at some point, somebody's behind me. Why is Vin? Come on, Vin. I don't know what happened to Vin. I just went He's past. He's back him. here. He's coming. There he goes. Oh my God. This is He's back in. This guy. This guy. This is like clown driving. To to her, that's totally cool. Whoa! What caution ahead, man. <laughs> <laughs> it's because somebody stucks in front of you. <laughs> yeah, we forgot you get slow. Someone's driving crazy. But it really means that somebody's either like their tires are spinning or they hit a wall or something's actually happening. But on this lap, it just means something funky's happening. Like, yep. If you see that in a race, Orange somebody problems. might have spun out in front of you. So just be careful. Okay. But it also. <laughs> I can't even. <laughs> oh, shit. Hey, if y'all make it through this, you're good to go. <laughs> <laughs> only, uh, yeah. Only 19 more laps to go after this one, right? Yeah, it's easy. Oh, Jesus. Oh, shit. Watch <laughs> 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 oh, 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 out. Hey, Cole. Oh, oh shit. Oh, All right, so we're just setting the pace right now and Sneaky Pie is taking it off thinking he's already starting the race. So we're uh, slowing it down a little bit while we go around the first lap just to set the pace for everyone. All right, we're good. We're good. All right. I think we're good. This is a 20 lap race. Keep it around 60. It is good training, though, to avoid Just hitting. Oh yeah. The very first uh, right turn on this is the uh, a pre ski turn, and it's a very sharp reverse canter yep. left turn coming right out of the docket. Right, That's probably going to show the uh, the most right. most chance of a spin out or or a collision, I'm sure. Oh shit! <laughs> we have a new, few new people starting today, so please bear with us while we go around the uh, the pace lap here. The best comedic relief. Really does. Everyone tunes in just to watch the pace lap. All right, looks like we're back on. So we have Sneaky Pie, followed by in the first position, followed by Laddie. All right, so wait until you cross the line. Search Industry is in third. Teen Idiot in fourth. Right, so after this corner, stay in position and. Oh, that, those red lines right there, right? No, it's the, it's up, it's up ahead. Where that... Uh, if you look on the map, it's, uh, or the... Yeah, now I can check off. Over. Yeah, go. Yeah, just get past that, once, you, yeah. once your timer restarts, just take off. Something like that, guys. Something like that. 
Jesus. What? And we're off. <laughs> what is happening? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap. I'll be back here. What the hell? Sneaky what Pie has fallen into second and Illati has gotten caught. way up in front oh, there. Man, <laughs> Followed by Pono. Pono putting some work in on his opponent. And we got a spin out. Oh, I feel like Lady McQueen here trying to get through the, the Oh, a lot of bumping, a lot of grinding. This is gonna be an exciting race. That first lap. First major turn is over, they're past the bridge, they're going to the drop-off, and they're approaching the left turn black run. Yeah, I did. <laughs> Let's go see our leader, D, D. Ricky. D. Ricky's out in front with a decent lead, going into the chasm. It's a tight right turn, followed by the tunnel. <laughs> we got G Kev on uh, hot pursuit of D Ricky uh, as they approach the lake turn here. It's, an, it's a nice uh, open left turn. Uh, the driver should be taking it a little bit higher and actually coming in closer to the uh, the left side as they uh, approach the turn, so they can keep their speed as they uh, round that. Um, we're coming around the the stad plats. Very gentle turn and going to the slalom. Let's take a look at the uh, the third. Let's take a look at Fat Attacks in third position. I mean, he's keeping a very close eye on the, on the two in the front there. He's running a 1963 Volkswagen Beetle. With a beautiful lime colored green exterior. Poto in fourth. So we got a nice little uh, pack up front. Everyone keeping a decent pace, but they can definitely see the prize at the end of their visor. Black Death, the leader of the Over 30 Clan in 5th. He's fallen a little bit behind and the rest of the pack seems to, to spread out. This is that uh, tricky first turn right out of the docket. It does require you to slow down quite a bit because the turn is a uh, full 180 degrees. So you do have to make sure you don't have too much speed going into that one or you will slam into the wall pretty easily. server connectivity is blocked. Daddy is keeping a close eye on Black. Who's talking again? And they're coming into the, it's kind of down the drop off, going into the black run. Let's take a look at Toucan Sam. He's currently in, currently in seventh place. Keeping an eye on Daddy up front. He's driving the 1965 Mini Cooper S. Nice black finish. He's uh, rocking a custom tune. Yeah, a little bit. If you're red, yeah, it's going to be harder. And I think that 8.6 acceleration is really helping in the long run, especially after that really tight first turn. Let's <laughs> take a look at Akul. Akul's running a uh, beautiful cherry red 1965 Mini Cooper S. Hey, where'd he go? Our red. Yeah. It's coming out of the festival turn, going into the sad plats about the about the approach of slalom. Let's take a look at the front runner before we get back to the rest of the field. <laughs> you know, Dickie has a commanding lead up in front. Oh, actually, no. If Fat attacks close second, usually I'm about three or four laps behind everyone. Is he gonna be able to take him here on the on the tight? A pre-ski well, turn. I have that, I have that spot, Again, yeah, he should be approaching this from the right and then cutting in hard so he can continue to accelerate around the turn. As you can see, D. Ricky's already pulling ahead of Fat no. as he exits the turn because of that um, approach that he had on the far right. So he's able to keep a lot more speed and momentum as he pulls through. But maybe his acceleration in his car is going to hurt him here because he's slowing down just a little bit and Fat is definitely making some progress on him. Let's go take a look at the rest of the drivers before we... <laughs> Before we continue with the front runners, uh, welcome. <laughs> We've already seen a cold 1965 red Mini Cooper. Need a break in ninth place, running a 1963 Volkswagen Beetle with a beautiful spot job. Yeah, that one grabs you. Until she puts some real, uh, real time to that one. She's uh, actually stealing a tune by G Kev, which is definitely 100% recommended if you are not familiar with tuning in the Over 30 Clan. Uh, stealing, I guess, is a really tough, tough word since it is just borrowing. But there we go. Moving on to Noble. Noble's rocking a 1968 Abrath. I'm just actually making a mess behind everybody. He's running a uh, custom tune. 
He has uh, sights on Anita Brake as they approach the Shazam going into the tunnel. And the tunnel's a, a great straightaway, so this is really, really uh, favors the cars with um, with higher acceleration. So, with the Noble rocking 9.3 acceleration, he's able to make a little bit of a um, uh, little bit of. Oh, is he going to pass Anita Brake? He passed Anita Brake on the inside um, on the late turn or going into the festival. Need a break now in ninth place. <laughs> Toucan Sam in tenth. And he, is he going to be able to pass both Need a Break and Noble on the right hand side? They're just coming out of the stud plats going into the solemn here. And Toucan Sam is running a 1965 Mini Cooper S uh, with a custom tune. It's the fourth, fifth lap and we're passing someone. That's not good, Ricky. Stop and go. Stop and go. Oh, I'm done. Oh, is Toucan Sam going to be able to make some. Right, let's get he able to, he, he's looking for a way to attack here. <laughs> he Is this the turn to do it? So they're coming into that uh, really tight turn, as I mentioned, right after the dock at the pre ski hole in the left hand turn. So let's see who favors the right hand side before they go into the the tight turn here and see if they can actually make some, some progress. Is he able to take them on the inside? I think he's actually going to try to go for it now. Do what? Oh, just can't quite hold it. Can't quite get the speed he needs to actually be able to take that attack on the uh, inner side. So he's just going to take his time. Um, he's going to keep his uh, close distance and, uh, and and see what everyone else is doing. So let's let's take a look at Laddie. Laddie's running a 1963 Volkswagen Beetle with a uh, tune by Fat. Currently in 11th place. Oh my God! She's just approaching the drop off, going into the black run. I had been laughing every right, single speaking. game, so. Yep. Yeah, we, we seem to be having some, some uh, technical difficulties. difficulties. Kind of comforting after a while. <laughs> Loading, please wait. <laughs> there we are. Hello, friend. She's just taking the shots turn here. Making some, uh, making some. Oh, she can be able to do some work here. Oh, she's going a little too fast. She can hit the wall. She, oh, just to barely avoid. A front collision there, weaving to the right the very last second. So, so they're coming around the tunnel, they just exit the tunnel, tunnel come around the lake, so going around the festival turn. Yes. Alright. And, and we can tell that uh, she's, she's looking to make up some position. position. I, don't I don't think she'll, she'll be in 11th place for much longer. Sure Let's take a look at Moof now. So we got the Moof cam. He's running a Army Green Volkswagen Beetle 1963. He's running a custom tune, 8.9 acceleration. Currently in 12th place. So, yeah. And Nidhi has fallen way back with his 1963 Volkswagen Beetle, running a beautiful blue and red stripe of a white body. But he sees, he sees Moof. Moof is uh, coming up here. Is he going to be able to pass Moof here on the outside of turn number eight? I'm eighth place. I'm way back. Sorry. Ooh, I, I just figured since your car was already bashed in on that side. Oh, yeah, Sneaky Pie has been lapped, unfortunately. Uh, currently in 14th place? 14th place. Running 1963 Hot Wheels. Tuned by Oh. Definitely lacking the acceleration. Nice, nice pass, T. I was going in front of you. Distry in... A in 1965 Mini Cooper S, tuned by yeah, Fat. Yeah, I see definitely uh, a lot of tunes being yeah. leveraged by Fat Attack. He is currently hey, the point leader area. in the Over 30 Clan series. My internet, I had a heck up in my internet. It me out. And he's far back in, in 15th DNA place. We, we'll, we'll catch up with him in a second. So we're currently on lap number, lap number six of 20. Yeah, I could do that. Ah. Oh gosh. <laughs> well, you can get drunk now, yeah. <laughs> D. Ricky is out in front with a decent. Actually, no, not a decent lead. There actually is a, a pack right now, so Fat Attack is close behind D. Ricky. Um, I wonder if he's actually going to make a move here. So they're going through the slalom. Um, they're about to come up to the carousel turn. This is a wide banking uh, left turn um, that's pretty long. It's a full 180 degrees, so um, they do have to slope right down here in order to make sure that they don't go up the wall. Um, is Fat going to try to go on, on the inside, or no? Nope, he's not. D. Ricky with that acceleration is just bellowing out of the last part of the turn there and continuing over the start line going into that really tight first turn the pre-ski turn again this is the tightest turn on the track 
requires the most amount of deceleration to get through without smashing into one another. And I'm sure we're going to see a lot of uh, a lot of fun on this turn as people start to bunch up. Um, in third place, we have Gkev, who we can see the leaders in the front there, but they do have a commanding lead um, going into into lap seven of twenty. Um, he just exited that really tough first turn. He's going um, over the bridge into the drop off. Uh, currently, um, and then left turn on the black run. Let's take a, another look at our leaders here. See if Fat Attack's going to make a push on uh, D. Ricky here on the inside. This is the black run going into the chasm. The chasm turn is a, is a fairly wide right turn. It allows for a lot of attack. And D. Ricky there taking the, the far left and then accelerating through the turn. I think that's a really good strategy because he's able to get a lot of ground there by accelerating the last portion of the turn. Where Fat taking the tighter angle is unable to keep that acceleration up near the end of the turn. But Fat, is, Fat seems to be attacking D. Ricky going in on the inside of the lake turn, currently going into the festival turn. This is a uh, very, uh, very light left turn. Then they're going over the, the straightaway, the stab plots, and into the slalom. This is a, a good opportunity if, if Fat has the acceleration necessary to catch up to D. Ricky, but it appears that D. Ricky has a higher acceleration than Fat. Let's, look, let's take another look at D. Ricky. See what he's running for a car. So he's running 8.6 acceleration, which is actually quite um, shocking since um, he seems to be a lot quicker and more nimble uh, after turns than Fat. Let's take a look at Fat is attacking here. So he's definitely keeping his distance. He's close. He's just biding his time as we complete lot number seven. So D. Ricky again taking that white, wide right attack on this turn, allowing him to continue to accelerate near the end of the turn and get some additional distance away from Fat. So you can see every time he goes through one of these tight turns, he's able to increase the distance between him and Fat quite considerably, which is giving him the, the benefit, obviously. G. Kev in third place. Pretty far away, but we have a bit of a bunch up. Do we see an attack for Zvindadu going to be able to pass Gkev? So Vindadu is pretty close to Gkev as they go through the drop-off. About to go to the black run, which is a very wide left turn. But it doesn't feel like he's going to be able to catch him here to be able to attack and, and try to take him and take his position. Oh, he is making up some speed here. Gkev is spinning his tires. Is this going to give Vindadu an opportunity to get in front of him? Unfortunately not. Not enough momentum. And they're just going into the tunnel now. Exiting the tunnel, taking a light left turn into the lake. Shindustry is getting passed again, unfortunately, being a bit of a roadblock for these uh, gentlemen as they uh, try to battle it out here on the 8th lap. Woo, boy, that's lucky. I'm starting to get sloppy. It's only 8 laps in. Oh, and Fat Attack spun out. Oh, he is in second place here. Now he's in fourth. He gets passed by Gkev and Vindadu. Oh, what a terrible... What a terrible, terrible outcome. So now... DH Ricky has a commanding lead going into turn number eight of this 20 turn... Or, not turn eight. Lap eight of this 20 lap race. Uh, he's a pretty commanding lead now because of Fat's uh, mistake there. Finally, enough little spittle got into the Let's right listen side. to the oh, car cam here. My God. It's a brand new controller. It's the pissing me off. I didn't need to yeah. know. Yeah. There's a 154. <laughs> <laughs> As you can hear, Fat's pit crew let him down with the controller. They really did. <laughs> <laughs> it was so weird. I need more saliva on the left side. <laughs> right side, right side. I need to get this. is our new second place leader going into turn number two. Um, he's about to hit the drop like off here in the like, black run. You know, Let's we'll see if there's an intact opportunity bit. for turn for <laughs> third place. So Vindadu currently in third, keeping a close eye on Gkev, unable to attack. So we have a bunch up between second, third, fourth, and fifth, and sixth, and then it kind of just opens up past that. We'll come back to the we'll come back to the driver cams in a second. Let's take a look at Fat. How's Fat doing? Yeah, well, it's it's brand new. That was my problem. Oh. It was like a Fat's keeping a close eye on Vindaddy and Gkev as they go through the tunnel here. Exiting the tunnel, that wide you left know, turn at Lake. Son, I bought... Stuff you leave. 
in the B button. Oh, was he able to attack it all here? I actually had to take it apart. And I took a little file. Or, like a little How's Pono doing? Pono's 1965 Mini Cooper. The beautiful anime top. I up, like, just following it down and putting it back together. Keeping yeah. an eye, you know, keeping his distance. Driving safe. Oh, we got a pass here. Black is trying to pass Pono right now. I mean, my thing was... This, if you're going to pass, this is the time to do it. This is the uh, slalom portion of the racetrack. It's actually quite straight, except for a couple of slight yeah. weaves left to right. As you expect with the name slalom. I'm just glad this worked, because I didn't know what to do. And he passed him, and he's currently in fifth place. Good job, Black. <laughs> I'm from Texas. I know what's going on. Oh, cool. Definitely uh, seen worse for wear in his oh. bumper. I guess he got rear-ended there a few times. But, um, you know, he continues down. He's about to complete his 10th lap. And enter lap 11. Or enter lap 10, sorry. Here's that first. Are we going to see an attack here on, on position 7? Oh, Toucan Sam eyeing that, but doesn't have the, uh, hasn't made up the distance to be able to take him on that uh, tight left you turn. So I got first place D. Ricky while he passes the last place driver. Just wondering if maybe he'll uh, have it, an accidental spin it or because of the obstruction on the road. <laughs> We got a bunch up with five, six, uh, place five, six, and seven here. Oh, they're just about to go into the tunnel. Pono close behind Black. I don't know where to pass on this stupid track. No idea. Slalom. Up on oh, place number seven, we have the out cold. Oh, it's on now. <laughs> oh, since we have some collisions up in. Uh... Trying to go to the left of you, and then you went to the left, and I was like, I can't stop. I'm in midair. <laughs> Fat attack eyeing up Vindadu. See if he can make a move here. Currently in fourth place. So that wipeout really cost him. He was currently he was second place and really close to the first place leader there. Not as much. I know that's weird, but, but that spin out really uh, really hurt him. Uh, only when your and he's been unable to make up the difference um, in the last four laps. Let's see if Black's making a move on Fat here. So Black is uh, you know keeping his distance. As we go into the second turn, everyone's kind of fanning out a little bit. Ooh, black! As long as you know what I'm talking about. Yeah. It's more funner, for sure. Much more funner. All the better. <laughs> oh, GDK spin. Ben, catch up! I can't pass both of you. Keep looking down, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, so we got a nice little fight here for a second and third and fourth position. As Vindadu makes a move on Gkev, I think Fat is about to attack Vindadu. Oh, here we go. Passing him on the inside oh of the lake turn, going into festival. Ah, oh, loses momentum and Vindadu is able to capitalize. Oh, but he's keeping the inside track. Is he able to actually take the advantage here as he goes past festival? Yeah. Wait, is that true, or...? <laughs> <laughs> oh and he passes Vindadu just past Festival going into the Stad Platz. Oh, and into the, the Slaloms. Oh, no, no! It's the first wall I've taken. Damn it. Hey, Sneaky Pie, is this your first race with us? Yeah. Welcome! You're doing great. Thank you. I mean, were you? No, I wasn't. Okay. Sorry about that. Do you need to just die this time in Chasm? Oh, you guys are like 30 
Oh, Let's check in with Gene Nitty, see how he's doing. Yeah, I'm on eight. <laughs> hey Nitty, how's it going? <laughs> are, are you not happy with the car selection, Nitty? <laughs> I'm not happy that I'm not running into people. How about that? <laughs> well, it was pretty exciting right at the beginning. <laughs> yeah. I avoided people and then I spun myself out of the beginning. Mm -hmm. Or hit that wall. Yeah, this is... Let's take a look at G oh, Kevin's yeah. second place here. Yeah, you made really yeah, D Rookie still has down. an absolute commanding lead yeah. out in front. I, I saw that little, it's currently uh, being the it's a, the real real struggle here is for the second, third, and fourth place as they bunch up going into the late turn, um, but approaching the uh, festival turn here. Yeah, G Kev just barely keeping that second place lead. They are making some uh, progress on um, on turn one. I wonder if he's running into any problems. Is D Rookie you know, spinning tires or no? He seems to be doing just quite fine. <laughs> He's approaching the slow one. <laughs> we do have a bunch up uh, back here in the need to break in the 11th, 12th, and 13th place. With me. <laughs> <laughs> Nisi battling with Sneaky Pie, trying to take it on the inside. Not able to capitalize on Anita as they go through the tunnel here. Let's take a look at uh, Noble, seems to be making some progress as well. Passing Sneaky Pie and making some moves on Anita break. <laughs> Sneaky Pie seems to be coming up from 12th place. Or no, that's Dodge. Dodge has moved 12th place. And laughing maniacally. <laughs> yeah. Being approached by Teen 80 here. I gotta get my last where I can. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, sorry, Vin. What's Black saying? I Fuck didn't four. know where GKF was gonna break. So Currently in 5th place. Black is... Taking on the second turn. It's 11 or 13 of 20. So far, been a pretty quiet race. Everybody in front. He's approaching the uh, the drop off what? here. What, what, going what? into the left <laughs> left turn black run, followed by the chasm. Let's take a look at uh, posts uh, position second, third, and fourth. So G Kevin second, Fat Attacks in third, Vindadi in fourth. Let's take a look at Fat and see how he's making a move on G Kev. Now we're going to start seeing the drivers being a lot more aggressive as there's only seven laps left. That was close to that wall. <laughs> How's Vindaddy doing? Better to get He's close then to keeping his distance it. between Fat <laughs> May have lost and GK. <laughs> Who needs mirrors? Yeah. It's really he's going to make the first mistake. Overrated. And Black is uh, coming up My threatening uh, um, you know, fourth and, and third as well. <laughs> So you can be able to make some time, some, some, some distance up over the next seven laps. Got ourselves a ringer here. Oh! Oh, we got a little battle for six and seventh as Pono passes two cam Sam. Oh, and two cam Sam gets taken out by out cold. Oh, what a dirty pit move! Ah, uh, totally by accident, but just just an unfortunate set of events for two can Sam as he was having a really good fight with Pono. <laughs> <laughs> Neo Cole takes, oh after taking God. his opponent out, passes him gracefully on the outer right side of the slaloms. You were worried about me wanting to do Demolition Derby. I'm having my own, yep, my own Let's take a look at D. Ricky in the first pl first place Wait, post position. The can? Going out of the second, and, uh, second turn here, uh, again a commanding lead. Six laps left as he approaches the drop off going into the black run. G Kev is pretty far behind. He seems to have a little bit of space between him and the rest right. of the, the no, field. No, no, okay. um, while Fat actually is still continuing to threaten G Kev. We were just having a little race there, and all of a sudden I looked down, and now and Cole is that behind in fourth me by place. That's fourth place is Vindadu, Fuck. followed by Black in fifth. Oh, sorry. Inside. Is Black going to be able to make a move? Right here. It's just too hard. Yeah, I'm trying. I'm in... Good move, good move. Black catches here. With only six laps left. He's going to have to make up some serious ground in order to threaten second, third, and fourth place. Six laps left. Here we go. We got a like professional announcer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. T-Ricky with a commanding lead out in front as he finishes the Stadplatz 
and goes into the slalom. Mute everybody but Oprah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Let's take a look at Anita Brake. Let's apply <coughs> some uh, forward no, 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 no. pressure on her. Hold her steady. As she approaches Noble on the side. Coming into the, the wide right turn chasm going to the tunnel. I was trying to give you a little boost. Whoa, there goes she kept what the crap? Sorry. He just came out of nowhere, like he hit the wall and then flew back in. GCAP in front. I'm getting my games confused because every time I see that helicopter, I just want to pull over and shoot it. We got Vendetti in third place here. Oh, did he just pass? Oh, he's taking second place. They are battling it here on the first turn of lap number 15. Oh, this is gonna be a battle. The second oh, turn does TV not have that much me. room for a pass here. Are ran. they able to? You, like, yeah, I saw and, yeah. and fat. Off the track, back on, and then went back off the same way. I was like, oh shit. Vendati takes second place. Fat making an aggressive move here as well. Yeah, it's a dangerous game. Racing. Yeah. Currently in third place, threatening second with Gkev. Yeah, oh, this is an exciting, controlled. exciting pass on. Yeah. On the black run turn going yeah. into the chasm. This is after the drop-off. This is a very, very light left turn, followed by a tighter right turn, but still plenty of opportunity for speed if you take the turn correctly. Is Vendetti no, making up any... Oh, oh Vendetti's <laughs> falling back, so Fatty's taking a little bit more of a lead, so he's definitely make, making more aggressive plays here as he aggressively breaks on the inside of turn... Sex at Lake. Fly past you. <laughs> he appears to be making up some ground on our front runner, uh, D. Ricky. We'll have to now keep an eye on Fat Attack to see if he's able to oh, capitalize on that. Let's take a look over at Black, currently in fifth place, threatening G. Kev in fourth and Vindu in third. Is he going to be able to make some? So we have a really exciting oh, second, third, and fourth, fifth place finish. On here on lap number 15, five laps left, not much time. Definitely being more aggressive. Coming into lap number 16. Right oh, everyone's being very oh, okay. careful here as they approach the docket. I try not to wander too much. <laughs> now remember, this is the tightest of the turns, the first turn after the flag. The pre-ski is a very tight left turn. You need to take this from the right-hand side or you're going to spin out your tires like Fat did. But Dad is now capitalizing on that as he took the turn much further to the right to begin with and is able to continue his acceleration, but Fat ends up pulling ahead anyway. Black threatening GCAB can't make a can't make a move. <laughs> Hits the wall, slams into the other wall, and loses Dang, position. Man, so insane. you know it's a, it's a risk, but you got to be more aggressive in these final laps. And it, it unfortunately has hurt Black this time as he falls back and is currently still in fifth position, but uh, definitely <laughs> fallen back from um, being a contender for fourth at this moment. Oh. Is GCAP going to be able to make a move here on Vindadu and Fat Attacks? <laughs> they're approaching the Chasm turn. This is, a again, a, a very semi-tight right turn going into the tunnel. It's more of a straightaway. This favors the cars with higher acceleration. You see Fat Attack is able to get some, some additional speed. He's aggressively braking, going into that lake turn trying to keep his lead over Vendadu who had to put on his brakes in order to avoid a collision so I think we're going to see Vendadu make a move here shortly as he seems to get really close to fat attacks hey quit throwing tires Vince throwing tires up there there's also another battle going on for 10th and 11th position Noble taking a small lead over Anita Brake here does Anita be able to make a move here. Oh, need a break being very aggressive against Noble. Going into Chaz in turn. <laughs> Here's a straightaway. Is her acceleration be able to make up some, some distance on Noble? Hell no. Go fighting. <laughs> oh, and Noble almost yeah. completely bails, and Anita Brake is able to take 10th place. Oh, and Noble instantly takes it back. <laughs> All right. What a battle we got going here in the in the back. <laughs> a battle for ten. Oh, well. A battle for ten. 
God damn it. Oh, whoa. Oh, shit. Oh. For her first race in the over 30 clan, her, uh, sh sh is it Shindustry? Search and Destroy. Search, Search and Destroy. destroy. Search and Destroy is doing yeah, quite well. Yeah. Definitely coloring, you. coloring in between the lines here. She does not have the most spin outs of all over 30 clan, clan members in this race yet. Actually, I should turn the other volume up. Yeah, now I can hear what you're saying. Guys, I'm going outside. Just pass me. I can't. I got no fucking shot here. Noble and Black still. Dancing for 10th and 11th place. Let's go back to our leaders here and see where everyone's at. Oh man. Fucking laps. Yeah, D Ricky in first place with a fairly commanding lead with only three laps left. The battle, I think, is really going to be for the second, third, and fourth position. As Fat has fallen a fair amount behind, he's going to have to drive very, very aggressively. And this, I think, aggressive stance that Fat is going to take is going to give the opportunity for GCAV to capitalize on any mistakes he might make. That should be its own competition. Black currently in fourth place. Has had a few white coats this, this game and, you know, still in a fairly decent post position going into lap number 18. Oh my god. That's hilarious. Oh my god. It worked for Fat. Fat taking the uh, far outside right of the first turn here and hugging the left to continue his acceleration. Doesn't appear to be making any any distance on third place, Gkev. Let's see where Vendetti's at. Vendetti has black in his sights. There is a fair gap between the two. Oh my god, come the fuck on. Oh. What's happening with you? Appears that black had a slight spin out. So Black had a little bump Black on the really side there, getting passed by Vindadu. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And Vindadu is able to pass Black and capitalize on that slight mistake. Black is definitely staying close. So is Black going to be able to, to pull back here from fourth, or from fifth and get back into fourth place position? He looks like he's trying to be aggressive here on the Chasm turn going into the tunnel. Tried the mini, but I, I so Fat appears like, to be making some moves and is able to uh, close the gap slightly over uh, first place D. Ricky. Is he able gonna, yeah, really gonna be able to um, gotta, you like, know the close this rather that. large gap in only two oh, two additional is, laps? Yeah, so like it's too stiff. And he's gonna have to drive much more aggressively as today. Vindadu is definitely spread out, falling back a fair amount oh, from okay. Fat as he finishes the festival turn, going into the stats plats and approaching the slaloms. Appears we have a, a little bit of a fight for 6th and 7th position as well, as Toucan Sam is making a move on Pono. Starting to close that gap and bunch up near. And again, they only have two laps left, so they're going to have to drive very, very aggressive if they actually want to better their post position. Which, again, provides a lot of risk. It appears Fad is making some serious distance up on our front runner, D. Ricky. <laughs> He's closed that gap quite considerably in the last lap. Just, just we're currently on lap 19, so we only got two laps left to really make a difference here. Is Fat going to be able to close the gap even further? If he's able to close the gap by one half on this next lap, I think he might have a chance of being able to take first place. We'll have to keep an eye on him for sure. Okay. So we have a fight for first and second, a fight for third, fourth, and fifth. They've bunched up. Sixth, seventh, and eighth. So sixth and seventh. So we do have... A bunch of exciting events that should happen. You didn't get that payment? So let's um let's take a look at Vindadu. <laughs> Vindadu is doing quite well here as he goes down the black run. Black Death <coughs> reclaimed his fourth place position. I think he's trying to go for third. He's trying to be a lot more aggressive as they approach the lake yeah, turn. This is a um uphill left camber turn. And GCAV in hot pursuit as well, so that's going to be an exciting third, fourth, and fifth place battle as we approach the last lap. And it appears D. Ricky up in front has um, stretched out his lead a little bit over Fat as they go into the straightaways of the Stats Plats and the Slaloms. Gives Fat and a chance to do some damage here. Fat does have better acceleration with a 6.6 .6 top speed compared to. 
D. Ricky's 5.8 top speed, so if he's able to do these turns clean, he could potentially make up some time based on his higher top speed. And better acceleration. So Fat is making a more of an aggressive play here on the second last turn as they approach the starting line. Going into that very tight turn number one. Oh, Fat taking a wider start to that turn. I think he's a little bit aggressive on the brake. I'll see you back there. Which allows oh, yeah, I'm D. Right Ricky to, uh -huh. every lap, to increase that gap. Few more laps. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we see Black is Black is attacking Vendetta. So there definitely is a, a battle for third, fourth, and fifth. A battle for first and second. We have a battle for sixth and seventh. It should be an exciting finish. In Going into the last lap. Oh my god, it's the yep. longest race of my life. <laughs> D. Ricky approaching the black run turn. As he approaches the chasm, going into the tunnel. Is T. Nitty going to provide some uh, some exciting ending to this as well Can as he gets lapped? It's almost over, but... Fat's going to have to be much more aggressive in order to be able to catch up. I think there's just too much of a commanding lead. So unless D. Ricky makes some sort of a mistake, or T. Nitty becomes a, a problem in this equation, I think we're going to see D. Ricky take this quite quite easily. On your left, Vin. I just hit him, Vin. Don't let Ricky pass. Don't let Ricky pass. Oh, shit! As he approaches yes. Tinity, he has to be very Fuck. careful here. Tinity provides there's no threat for post position, but oh, if he so ends up accidentally there. bumping D. Ricky, he can completely screw up his plans. D. Ricky's been leading 95% of the, the race so far, so it'd be absolutely devastating if this is the, the cause of the issue. You can tell he's being a lot more careful, though. This is giving Fad a little bit of opportunity to actually catch up. Let's take a look at Fad here. Oh, D. Ricky's going to take first place, followed by Fat in second. Let's see what we got here in third, third, fourth, and fifth place as they approach the the flag here. So this is going to be Vendetti in third, Black in fourth, G. Kevin fifth. So close. Let's take a look at Pono. See if he's going to make a another lap. You would have had me. So we got Pono in sixth, two Cam Sam in seventh. Because that was my thing too. I was like. I just don't know where to pass because like you can you can catch up to certain spots and you're like I can almost pass here. The yeah, total an eighth. And then I'm gonna run into the side of it. You right. know. Fat usually the best place to pass is when the, my baby starts crying. I let you go. Laddie in ninth. Passed you right before. I tried too hard. Um, Noble and Anita were battling at one point, but Noble has a commanding lead over Anita. So, except for some mistake, yeah. they're going to see third place? Noble in 10th, Anita in 11th, Tinity in 12th, Noble gets 10th place, Anita in 11th. Oh yeah, we'll do it right after. You guys were faster than me, but you couldn't pass me because uh -huh. I just kept, I wouldn't let you have the inside. But you know, we were faster in different places. Uh, because I know that Vin was faster than me in the straights, and you were way faster than us, like in those super tight turns. You guys were faster. Alex Let's go to the drivers now for some commentary. I was losing, um, yeah, position to you guys. It, um... I think I think it was because you were going so fast down that hill, honestly. Mm -hmm. And I was breaking later than you, or I mean earlier than you, and I you were still going, and I think that's where he lost a little bit. So let's like, go to right. our first place driver, D. Ricky. How do you feel? <laughs> That's right, D. Ricky. He's gonna fall back into place soon, soon enough. D. Yeah, Ricky, he's absolutely back. speechless. He's gonna start at the back like the rest of us. Uh -huh. <laughs> right. well, he started what? He started eight. Ah, that's true. <clears throat> Actually, you know what? Z. Kev was up oh, there in that. the front before I got up there and I was like well oh, that wreck that wreck on the oh, the, oh yeah the first that corner. thing has really good acceleration out of a stop yeah I saw that you that's, just 
jet it. See, D, Ricky, Noble, and Victory. That's why when I hit that wall, all of a sudden, huh? I just rocketed in front of you guys at one time. That was so weird. I was like, how did you hit the wall and then fly past us? Like, I was like, oh, we got past GCAP, sweet deal. And then you were like, wow. <laughs> like, poop on you guys. <laughs> <laughs> well, I I was fully expecting to be passed, and then all of a sudden I started gaining on Vin, and I was like, okay, I'll pass him. No, you flew in ahead of us, and then we're just like stagnant again. Oh, it was Ricky, ridiculous. Fat Vin, me, Kev, Ono, Sam, Cold, Lad, Noble, Anita, Nitty, Fed, Cow, Moof, Sneaky. I'm in if you're looking for people. No, I'm going through the results. <laughs> okay. And before you get one point, because I people who are in the race and get disconnected, I just give them the one point instead of a zero for not showing up. <clears throat> That's a good race. Oh that was, yeah. That was one of the best races. <laughs> Yeah, it was actually really exciting to watch. There's a, yeah. a lot of really good battles, the first, second, and third place there. Um, you know, even even the battle you uh, and Noble were having, Anita, <laughs> was a lot of fun. In 10th and 11th, right? Let's see. You know, a couple devastating sin outs, which caused some problems. Who's that? Just went by me. Oh, those are our driver tours actually at this point. We're not driving anymore. Wow. Yeah. I didn't think you were, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you gotta watch out for so them. They do not they are, care they about you at all. And that concludes the racing series for this week. Thank you very much for tuning in. Um, yeah, please follow if you'd like to see more. Put my kids in bed and I'll be right back. This is a weekly occurrence from the Over 30 Clan. www.over30clan.com um, You can see us on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter. Catching Have a great up, night. Ben. Thanks again. Catching up on points. <laughs> I only got five on you. I'm just, I, if I would have finished anywhere in the top five, it would have been happy.